I saw the Hivernal flying by with my own eyes, big as the sky, and ready for the lords to come be heroes. We take it down, and the village nearby will eat like kings and love us for it. It had bright red and blue scales that we worth a fortune even beyond the horde. That's not a Hivernal. You saw a Colton's on. And she's acting normal. She's not one of the dragons blighted by the gods. Going after her would get us killed for no good reason. I'm gonna have to side with the Lords of Fortune's resident dragon expert. You sure you're not just scared, Tosh? Fight it if you want. Tell us where to send your stuff after it kills you. Aw, oh, sorry, Cutter. Tosh gets final say. We leave the Cultons on alone. You think I can't fight a dragon just because I don't breathe fire? You can't fight a dragon because you don't know what you're doing. Fine. You're the expert. I guess he couldn't handle the heat. Not like you can, huh? Oh, it doesn't bother me. <laughs> There's rumors of another dragon off to the west. Heard anything, Tosh? Yeah. Not sure if it's blighted like the ones that attacked Minrathis and Treviso. But it's killing people in villages near Arlothan Forest. They need help. Well, that's glory. It's fire breather. They always have lairs with a horde. And there's gold. Tempted yet? We might be able to spare the time for a dragon hunt. Can't wait to see what you find. Now, has Tash told you about fighting a Gamadon Stormrider in the middle of a typhoon? Best time to catch him. Oh, it was glorious, Rook. <laughs>